are going to be learning how to use Bootstrap 4. Now, what is Bootstrap? Well, Bootstrap is one of the most popular frameworks for building mobile-first uh, websites or applications, okay? And what is so cool about Bootstrap is it is pre-built with loads of uh, classes and styling right out of the box. So what that means is when you are building some of the UI like buttons or using fonts or nav bars, it has pre-built classes already for you to help you add styling to these things so you don't have to do it from scratch. On top of that, because Bootstrap is built using mobile first, it's got all the media queries already included for us so that the display, the viewport, knows when the breakpoints are when you have different screen sizes. So, for example, our DevSlopes website, uh, which you see here, we used Bootstrap 4. So let me show you this. So right now the viewport is on a desktop screen size. And then as we adjust the screen to become smaller, you'll see it hits a break point here, right there, which would be a larger tablet or iPad. And then as we shrink the display even more, now you can see that it's hit more of a mobile state. And you can see our little uh, uh, side menu here that pops out. And this is gonna be used for like smaller iPads or tablets. And then it even shrinks all the way down to mobile. So it has these media queries built in for us and just can detect the uh, breakpoints. So pretty cool stuff. Now, another thing to note about Bootstrap 4 is this is an alpha stage. And what that means is the version of Bootstrap before this was Bootstrap 3. And Bootstrap 3 is a completely stable, uh, polished, finalized version. And then this Bootstrap 4 is still in an alpha stage but still stable enough that we trust it to use it for our own website and the reason we're going to be learning about the bootstrap 4 is because we want to teach you the latest and greatest okay and over time uh, this thing is obviously going to be a hundred percent stable version it's going to be finalized and polished and bootstrap 4 introduces a lot of new features and it has uh, some significant changes uh, from bootstrap 3 so we want to teach you the latest and greatest. We want you to stay on the curve of uh, what's hot. And that's it. So that's Bootstrap 4, an overview. Let's dive into actually using it and building some projects with it.